Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel, welcome to my deck, and welcome to my blog, Coffee, Tea, Wine, and Life. And today, well it's about 7 o'clock at night, I have got cannoli, cup of, my cannoli cake cappuccino from Smart Sips Coffee. I've got it in my best state ever mug from Sabrina, Jelly Beans, Mike, and Puppy Dog Angel. So anyway, cheers everyone. I hope you are having a fantastic day. Mm, I love my socks. Smart Sips Coffee, so good. But anyway, so yeah, it's about seven o'clock at night, but it is humid. Uh, my friend Alexa says it isn't going to rain tonight, but there is some thunder in the background going on. Um, so I'm not sure if it's, maybe we're just gonna have some heat lightning and stuff later on, but it is very, very muggy out here. Kind of felt like I wanted a margarita, but I thought I would have coffee instead. I got another Scentsy warmer this week that from my uh, Scentsy guru, our daughter Raina. So she sent me a surprise warmer, so I'm excited to share that. So it's a Halloween warmer. So I'm in my Halloween gear, so I can properly show that off. And I have, I'm so behind on boxing. I don't even know where to do. And it's not even so much the boxes that bother me because I could just open them, but I just, I'm so far behind. Yeah, we have been so busy at work that it is crazy how busy it is. And um, we are busier now and have sold more machines than we did in our busiest year. And I've been there for about 23 years and we still got a couple of months to go. So it is crazy busy. And I think if anybody pays attention or has heard anything about the news, all the sea vessels that are out at sea, with no one in the docks to um, unload the vessels. Customs, people aren't working in customs. It's very, very slow trying to get the export paperwork and things. And I've got machines coming in from Japan out on sea vessels. So I probably have about 30 calls a day trying to answer questions that I have no idea. The vessel's in line to get in port. There's 60 ships before it. I can't even get it to go to another port to try to get it in because there's nobody at that port either. You know, it's kind of, you know, when they say part of it is because so many people have, um, you know, bit with COVID, COVID and of course they got the time off and the incentives and the thank you gratises and the stimuluses to stay home that a lot of them didn't go back to work even though the restrictions have been lifted because all they have to do is say, oh, COVID. And so they've got free health insurance, they've got um, stimulus checks coming in, extra bonuses from their unemployment. Um, some, some people are getting their rent waived and stuff like that. And it's like, what about the poor landlords that still have to pay the mortgage? And they've got all these people renting from them that aren't paying rent. So I have no idea what's going on. Something about a woke society, I don't know, but it's nice to get things back to normal. So uh, last week I worked I think I worked two days to midnight, two days till about 11 o'clock. One night I left early at 9.30, so like a 13 hour day, 13 and a half hour day. So that felt pretty good. I actually went in to work yesterday for about eight hours. I was gonna go in today, but I was just too pooped. And I, you know, I wanted to do things around the house. I still had to vacuum and do dishes and you know, just do some cleaning and things like that. So, so um, yeah, I didn't go in today. I probably should have, but I didn't. But. Anyway, so I did into a blog the last couple of weeks just because I've just, ugh, you know, it's just been so busy and I was sick for a little bit there with some sinuses and my face was swollen and I had headaches and that just wouldn't go away. So yeah, I, I needed to catch up on sleep when I wasn't working and I don't even remember the last time I read. So I, you know, once your face is swollen and your head hurts and your eyes are swollen and shut, it's kind of hard to read. It's kind of hard to want to do a video too. You know, sometimes so it's fun to hide behind and pretend it's a mask. Yeah, I, I would just totally do that. But anyway, I'm just gonna, gonna try to get on with this vlog. I don't know if I'm going to finish it up on Friday and then post it on the weekend or if it might run into a couple of weeks. We'll, we'll just kind of see how it goes. I mean, I have got like glossy box that I haven't opened up. I've got my Ipsy Glam Bag. I've got an Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I've got my Yoga Club. I've got an extra um, set, the additional collection from Miss Ellie. My September um, outfit of the month that I pushed up like two weeks. They, 
sent it shipped two weeks ago, but when I check on the EPS label, it says it's not picked up. So I don't know if that means it's lost, if it's shipped, or if I should just kind of wait and be patient. Just chill. Have a cup of coffee and chill. But yeah, so today was just another gorgeous, gorgeous day. So I, you know, after I did some housework, I went out and did a little bit more weed whacking down the hill there where it's kind of like overgrown and crazy. And I didn't want to overdo it. But I did want to come on and do a quick video today. And I got, you know, I got that another sensory warmer that I'm real excited to show you. So we're going to do that right after. But I won a little giveaway from Life with Lois. And if you aren't familiar with Life with Lois, I'm sure you probably are if you're watching me. But just in case, I will leave her below. She is just an awesome, awesome, sweet lady. She's very soft-spoken, just a really nice speaking voice. And she lives in Michigan. And so she does beautiful work in gardens and she does, you know, unboxings as well and face mask Mondays and some wellness Wednesdays. And she takes us sometimes along on like some hiking trips and when she's her and her husband are fishing at the lakes and it's just such a beautiful area of Michigan that she lives with. And I think last year she also posted some items, uh, videos showing the snow that they had. So just really, really fun. She's over um, a thousand subscribers, but I think she doesn't have the watch hours. So if you do catch Life with Lois, please try to watch her, you know, some more of her videos and just try to, even if you're busy in the kitchen or you're doing some housework and you start to watch it, maybe just do a couple of other things while it's on to let it play and, and remember to comment and click on like because that really helps with the algorithms and for YouTube and getting our channels recognized and posted because you figure you know they're playing ads on our stations anyway now channels anyway now right so why should they get all the money so it'd be nice to get us monetized too so that we can get a little bit of cash even if it's just a little bit to pay postage or just a little bit to say ah, this is fun yeah this is fun but anyway so anyway i want to give away the life below she had like a little kind of like a sneaky peek thing on one of her um face mask mondays so I was so excited when I came home last week, I think, and I think I came home, I think that was the night I worked till 9.30, and I said, oh, I'm going to get to watch some Face Mask Mondays and try to catch up on YouTube a little bit, and I was so excited when she pulled my name. So, yeah, I was so excited. So it came in an Ipsy bag, yeah. So when I went out to the mailbox and I said, Ipsy, I already got my Glam bag, I got my add-ons, I got my Ipsy Plus, oh, what else did I order? And then I looked at the front, and it was from Life of Lois. So, I'm excited to get into this, so let's do this. Take everything out of this bag. Pretty cool. So we got, we got some masks. This is really exciting. Yeah, I love getting into the Space Mask Monday. And yeah, see, we cannot blame Justina for that because if I hadn't won one of her contests, was it a year ago or two years ago? I never would've gotten to face masks because it was just something that kind of freaked me out. I have no idea why, but I love it. So if you do not do face masks, you owe it to yourself to do it. I feel like my complexion, and of course I'm mid-60s, I feel like my complexion is better than it's been since I was a teenager. Yeah, you know, it's slowly coming back to life. I think drinking water helps, trying to make smarter choices and food and things helps. Probably not drinking all this coffee, but hey, there's water in there, right? Yeah, so anyway, just got this little card. Just got a little flower here. So cool. And little kitty cats here. Thank you with little paw prints, like the paw prints puppies leave on puppies and kitties leave on our hearts. And uh, yeah, it's a short little note inside. I don't think she would mind if she read it. So she says, Nancy, I hope this finds you well. Enjoy your mask. Have a blessed night, day, week. And another little flower. Thank you for being a loyal subscriber. I am so happy you won my giveaway and I hope you enjoy everything. Life with Lois, dear friend. So just, oh, so nice. Little picture right there with some flowers. So creative and a little smile. So, so nice. Awesome. Yeah, I think I was just kind of maybe expecting one mask, but so this is really cool. So it's glad we got and I love eye mask too. I mean, I'm really not sure if it's helping with the puffiness, but oh my God, it feels good. And when my eyes were swollen, I used these a couple of times a day. So this one's called Magic Eye Skin Camp Collagen. 
So you know, I am going to pop that one. And I don't think it's an eye mask. So let's see what this one says. I got this. Deep Puffins and Brighton. So it is an eye mask. Okay. I'm a graphic, so that one should be real pretty. <laughs> hand mask. I need to do some hand mask. I got my first hand mask last year. And at first I thought it was going to be kind of creepy, like, what do you do? And after I used a hand mask, it was like all week, my hands felt great. And I could still put it on. I could still kind of type on YouTube. It was kind of slow, but I only type like this anyway. So yeah, it worked out really good. So thanks, Lois. That was really cool. And a foot mask. I've never done a foot mask, but I would love to try this one with rose water. I love rose water. So good. That just the, the fragrance I love. And it looks like I got another eye mask. So this is really, really a nice variety. So 24K gold under eye patches from Demora. And yeah, this little more. Focus. Alrighty, aloe. Aloe 99. A jelly mask. Sounds good. An exfoliating one. So this looks like maybe a three-part one or a two-part one. So we'll have to check that one out. A cleanser. Ooh, a sleep mask and a polishing pad. Alrighty. I might have to use this one tonight. Ooh, this one's got a pretty, pretty cover. So this one is Mer Merbles, Merlis Wedding Dress. So that one looks really pretty. Looks like an aloe plant off to the side there. So that should be really nice and moisturizing as well. Got another aloe vera mask, which is just really, really nice and soothing. And I remember growing up, I was like the darkest skinned one in the family. You wouldn't think so, but I'm the darkest one because my brothers and sisters, well, they have like bright red, orange hair. And whenever we went to the beach, they would sunburn because plant squatting was not a thing back then so they would oh my god they burned so bad and they would get blisters and we always came home and my mom would rub them down you know break open one of the aloe plants and just kind of rub it on them and soothe them and i would be the one out there with baby oil on and all kinds of uh, lotions yeah all i got was freckles i never burnt i burnt once in my life okay two times in my life all right and then another one of these exfoliating ones the three-step one. So thank you so much, Lois. I was not expecting all this. This is really amazing. And um, yeah, I am going to enjoy using each and every one of these. Oh, I think it's one of the best things that we can do for ourselves. It's just a little pamper time. You know, just kind of put it on, even if you don't do YouTube or anything after that, just kind of put it on, relax like this with your mask on, and just take 15, 20 minutes to just veg, just calm down chill out and you're doing so many wonderful things to your your skin and helping your complexion glow from within and just being able to rest in just 10 minutes of 10 15 minutes of stress free relaxation so anyway thanks again everyone and we will probably try to come in again during the week or next weekend or something to close a vlog just say how the week's gone and i just want to thank life with Lois again. Again, she's a sweetheart. I hope that you check her out and subscribe. Watch some, some of her videos. Help her get those. I'll watch hours up. And again, I hope you give this video a thumbs up and we will chat again during the week or on the weekend. Bye-bye everyone. Hi everyone. Welcome back to the end of the week. So actually last week I worked every night till 10, 11, 12 and Friday night I was at till one o'clock. I actually went back in today. Yeah, who knows why? But anyway, I went back in today. Got a lot done. But anyway, it's about eleven o'clock now, and yeah. So I just wanted to kind of come on close the vlog because when I started my vlog last week, I included my winnings from Life with Lois, and so I just wanted to kind of make sure I got that out without it being. I don't know if you heard that. I'm hoping it's a firecracker that my friends was pretty loud through closed windows alrighty so I'm back yeah I don't know what that was but it was it was loud but there's a couple of police cruises that I went out to kind of look out to see if I could see anything going on or 
big piece of wood, it's just a firecracker, but there's a couple of police cruisers going through the neighborhood, so I'm just going to stay right inside. Yeah, so I'm going to continue on, my friends. So, anyway, I um, just wanted to finish up the blog, and when I started my blog last week, I included my giveaways. Um, I, I won a little thing from Life with Lois. I was so excited because I was only expecting, you know, to get a face mask, and she sent me this bag, an Ipsy bag full of face masks and some eye patches. My, I'm not eye patches. I'm not going to be a pirate. Some eye mask and a foot mask and a hand mask, and it was like, I'm so excited. I used a couple of them this week already, and yeah, so thank you, thank you so much, Lois. I really enjoyed them, and it was so much fun uh, winning, and uh, yeah, and Oh, it's just such a fun feeling when you win things and know that you're watching people and you're supporting their channel and they watch you back and support you. So it's just, it's just an amazing thing, this YouTube thing, even if I don't actually get it, get it because Lois is like double me in subscribers. So she's over a thousand subscribers, but I don't think she's monetized yet. It's got something to do with watch hours, which I don't understand because she, like I said, she's like double me and she doesn't have the watch hours and I'm under a thousand and I've got the watch hours but I don't get that many comments and that many people click and like but so yeah I, I, maybe somebody's trying to help my channel grow with the watch hours so thank you guys for doing that by the way really appreciate it but anyway so if you I will leave like with Lois um, below in my description. She is just such an awesome, awesome lady. And if you guys can help her get her watch hours in so she can get monetized, that would that would really mean a lot to me. It's just really a great way to support us here on YouTube. And yeah, so it was a long week again. Yeah, I know you're probably tired of, of me saying that. I don't know when I'm going to catch up. I worked every night this week, I, and of course I, I don't take lunch, I work to my lunch hour, we don't get paid for that, and so I work by 10, 11, to like 10, 11 o'clock at night, last night I was there till 12 o'clock, I went in today for like 8 hours, and I feel like I'm getting somewhere, but every time I turn around, there's like a new stack of things for me to do, I don't get it, so I can't be that slow, right, I'm like the bottleneck, yeah, but you know, and the, but but I do go go over things that I shouldn't have to go over, and I happened to go over six of the machine orders, and I found some mistakes on them, from what a vendor had come back with, and so the mistakes on it were over a hundred thousand dollars. So if I didn't catch it because the sales guy didn't catch it, I don't know. It's not my responsibility, but but yet I feel like it is when I catch things. So anyway. I just saved somebody a hundred thousand dollars so to me it's worth it right it's better than having and of course these machines aren't going to be uh, delivered till like next May um, April April and May so for it to be in the system that long and to get there and it's wrong and I could have stopped it because I knew it even though they tell me it's not my job to do that it's a sales guy's jobs to check the machines I don't know am I am I yeah so I'm, I'm just gonna keep doing it that's what I do. So yeah, I'm because I just sometimes I'm too detail oriented and I look at everything. Yeah, it slows me down. It saves, saves money in the long run, but it slows me down to make making sure it's right. But anyway, so yeah, so I went in today. Got feel like I got a lot done. It rained all day, so it's a really great day to work because otherwise I probably would have been out doing yard work and then I'd be kind of sore. Even the last time I went out, I said, oh yeah, I did this, I did that, yeah, and I'm not sore at all. And then I fell asleep and I woke up and yeah, I couldn't move, I was sore. Yeah, it, the body really tricks us sometimes. You think you're okay, but you're not. But I still have to go out and do some more yard work for the fall because now the leaves are starting to fall. We've been getting all this rain, my grass is getting nice and green again, which means it's starting to grow, which means I probably have to move along. And I should bring it out anyway because I want to have to stop mulching up the leaves. It's just one thing after another, isn't it? But, anyway, so I just want to kind of come on quick and just uh, thank everyone again for your support. And I just wanted to, again, thank Lois from Life with Lois on winning those face masks. That was, that was, that was really an awesome, you know, I came home and I just thought it was an Ipsy bag. And I'm like, oh, what did I order now? And then I turned it over and said, oh my God, it's, it's what I want. And so, yeah, this kind of brings a smile to your face and just kind of puts you in a really happy mood. 
So anyway, I think I said that too much already. As you can see, I got I got stuff behind me. Yes, I do. I have got a boxy charm. I don't know if it's a regular boxy charm or if it was boxy lux. We'll figure it out later. I've got a glossy box behind me. I've got my Ipsy Glam bag plus, which has a little green sticker that says it was opened because it was when I got it, it was open. And I keep meaning to go online and so I can figure out what I'm missing if I am missing anything. I got some extras from that Ipsy Glam bag plus. I got the regular little tiny Ipsy Glam bag. I got a little bit of extras from that. I got some books behind me that um, I. I am pretty sure I recorded it when I opened my book of the month, but I don't think I uploaded it, so I have to look all looking for that. I got my Miss Ellie, my additional collection that I got, and I, I thought I recorded it, but I can't find it. I knew I didn't do the try-on part, but I can't find it. And then I got my Yoga Club, which had an extra pair of leggings in it by mistake that they said I can keep. So I did um, I did record that unboxing, but I didn't record the trying on part yet. And then I got my, the one that I was really excited to get was my Miss Ellie, my September outfit of the month. It came in October, yeah, because it, and I had it come up, I, I think I, it shipped by the 10th, and yeah, so shipping is, shipping is crazy, and you can't really get mad because who knows exactly what's going on with logistics and shipping, but and now the post office says they're going to get slower starting this weekend. So we will see how that really affects shipping everywhere. So anyway, so I got those three to fin kind of finish up. And is that all I have behind there? Yeah. Oh, and I wanted a special um, Smart Sips coffee. So I should be getting that probably on Monday, and I ordered two again. So it'll be one for me and one for one of you that, uh, so when I do that video, um, yeah, I'll do a little giveaway. So it'll be one box for me and one box for one of you guys out there. So I'm excited to be doing another little giveaway. And yeah, so just my most important here, I just wanted to come on and thank Life of Lois, Lois from Life of Lois on, on winning. And if you can help her out by helping her with some watch hours, that would be super fantastic. Speaking of super fantastic, I hope that you guys all go out, have a great rest of your weekend, uh, just stay safe and take care of each other, and it's just crazy, it's like every time you go on Facebook or you hear the news, there's like another shooting, there's like, whether it's school or a business or domestic violence or people killing their kids and their children and babies, and uh, so... We've got to do something. We've got to try to love one another and respect each other and stay indoors, maybe. Stay away from windows and stay indoors. I, I need to go check and see if there's any more commotion with that noise I heard. So, take care, everyone, and we will chat, chat again soon. See you next time. Bye-bye.